Hey, what's up YouTube? I got something pretty cool to show for you guys today. All of you FPV pilots who are flying with 2.4 gigahertz for control are going to find this really useful. This little goodie here is called a Dora board or a Dora module. Uh, no, not the kids show. This uh, Dora stands for DSM on RSSI input adapter. Now, what does that mean? Well, for those of you who are familiar with analog radio signals, RSSI means Received Signal Strength Indicator. So basically what that does is it says, here's your radio signal. Here's, it's either at 100% or any of the way down to 0%. And it'll tell you the further and further you get away from your transmitter as your radio signal degrades. But Digital radios don't really degrade like that. You either get a digital packet or you don't. You either have a one or you have a zero, on state or an off state. So you can't really do RSSI on a digital radio. So basically the way that we deal with that is we take this thing called the Dora board and we plug it into the data port on our Spectrum radio. And what it measures is three things. It uh, measures antenna fades, frame losses, and holds. An antenna fade is usually caused when your uh, DSM2 or DSMX uh, radio either switches from one antenna to a remote receiver or when it switches frequencies. And those happen every once in a while um, and they're not really that dangerous but it's good to know that they're going on because it means that your radio is struggling a little bit to get that signal out to your airplane. The second one is frame losses. That's where you lose an entire packet and your plane will jitter for a second and Dora will bring you down to about 20 to 40 percent of your regular signal because that's an entire loss of a second, of control, a second or so of control. It's not something very good. And then there's the third one, which is holds or lockouts, which is where your radio locks completely and s loses multiple packets. And the uh, Dora board translates that to 0%. So basically what this does, very simply, is you plug this into your data port. And out of there is RSSI. And out of there is ground. And you feed that right into your OSD. Now, it's not as accurate as an analog RSSI would be. Uh, because it's not true RSSI, it's just measuring the nasty stuff that can happen to your digital radio and kind of factoring that into a semi-accurate calculation about how your, um, how, how your signal is doing, how far away you are, etc. But it's 20 bucks, plug it into your OSD and you'll know when your 2.4 control is getting pretty close to locking out. So don't forget that, it is helpful, it might save you a plane and it's really tiny, look at that. It's just a uh, like square centimeter and a half. So do it, pick one up if you fly on 2.4 or stick it in your OSD, don't lose your airplane. Remember, if you like this video, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you next time.